Eamon. Jake Doyle working well to get the ball back here. Beats two or three. He's able to link up and he's looking for the return ball. and Just not enough, but it could fall nicely. New City have a huge chance here. Oh, that's... That's Pull one of them ones there. where he just leans back and Dino Shea trying to get the noggin on it. He does, he adds to it, but it's mopped up there by Donald Higgins. A couple of loose touches and it falls to Carl Chambers, who lovely little ball over to Jordan Adiemo, and there's options in the box here, but Adiemo's gonna go himself. Ooh. Oh, and it was a good shot. Kean Moore had it all to do there. Been as clinical as we'd usually see from this UCD side, but they're not going to panic because, as we said, Jordan Adiemo isn't covering the ground. Uh. And it's a long one down, and it could be dangerous. He's let it bounce, and he's in here. And it, oh, and it's just can't get the connection on it. That's a huge let off. Jake Doyle there. Ferdon. Ferdon just happy to send it back to Hulin. Centre half over to. Clancy opts for that lovely ball down the line oh what a pass and UCD are in here this could be 1-0 they're queuing up for it oh what a clearance and a second bite of cherry and a brilliant save can long for clear the lines I think, I think Jordan had the ammo oh that's oh it's nice and it, it, oh, I thought he might have hit that it was just bouncing up for him maybe but ah, Bastion mother. here he tries to play one and yes! it's gone oh! in Oh my god! It's a what complete, a goal! It's a complete mess up at the back here by Kean Moore. I thought it was sailing over the crossbar. Uh, Bastion Heary, we'll see it on the replay here, Gary. Going into Galway United Premier Division Club and. Full time football, yeah. of course. So you have to take these opportunities when they come, and UCD with a bit of a training ground move here. Longford looking for offside. Can the cross come in? Yes, it can. There's two UCD men, and it's a goal for UCD. 1 1. As easy as you like. A training ground move there. Here, yeah. Gary, just like bashing here with a nice little run there. He picks out Carl Chambers and Victor. He's pushing up and he finds Frank Campbell and he's looking for Shane Alwardy, who was probably just a little bit deep at the time, but gets his cross away. And it's in around the six-yard box and a Longford Town corner and a bit of a scary moment there. It was probably wasn't the but as I say that Shane Alwardy tries to get a cross into the box and it's well yeah. intercepted and. Straight Longford. into the Tylus. Longford with a throw in. In UCD territory once again. And Dino. Ooh. It looked as if Dino Shea was making his way over, but he's gone for a cross and Norris with the header, and he'd be disappointed with that, Gary Riley. Another attack, Shane Elrody with that ball down the line to Jordan Adiemo. Adiemo looking to try and get a cross in here, maybe. He's telling Elrody where to go, but he opts to go back to Victor. That's a poor, poor ball by Victor, but falls to Bastion Heary. Has a go. Ooh. Too many bodies in the way. I suppose when you score one in the first half, not afraid to have a gink. Chambers in absolutely acres of space. Just, just seemed to switch off for a second yeah, there, Yeah, completely, guy. yeah. And Longford Town near, almost punished them. UCD bringing a couple of the big men all in around the penalty spot here. Three or four lads. Looked like Dean O'Shea was going to give a long one, but he gives it to Victor Sreniuk. Oh. And what a shot. A rasping shot there. And just goes wide up the, the upper and play with it and yes they have and it's McCullough again running at that long for town defence three red and black shirts in front of him though pulls it back to O'Regan back to McCullough it's a ball in and the keeper comes and it's a goal for UCD and it's a another mistake at the back from a goalkeeper I think Halwax he calls he comes for it and take the throw Elrody throws it back to him and it's nearly as if he's surprised he got the ball yeah exactly you know I think uh bit more tuned in he has played all right so far oh no that is a hit and hope ball there and it could go anywhere and it's fallen to the ucd man and that really could have been three and there's a big collision here between halwax and the ucd striker i think uh, really good play by rossway trying to make, take it down oh shane Elrody with a ball here better ball daniel norris surely being a bit impeded there i don't think the ref's going to give it though I'm not, never going to get a penalty for that. Kyle O'Connor with one into the back post. Let it bounce. Oh. There's a, he's looking for it. Uh. I don't think it is, but it was a good ball in. and It was heading off to the sideline there. And Adam Wickstead standing over this. And everyone's up for Longford. The only man left at home is Kyle O'Connor. 
Hopefully a good ball in by Wickstead and it looks like a good ball into Emmanuel James. Just couldn't get the header on it. Yeah, it but no, like no one talking to other there. That's brutal stuff. Looked like a breakdown in communication between Emmanuel James and Dino Shea. Dino Shea.